Developing now in court today, the man accused of murdering a Prince George's County teacher will remain behind behind bars. That teacher is Miriam Sela seen here. He was denied bail this morning. Our Yamari Sase covers Prince George's County now. She has the latest. 33 year old Harold Landon III is facing several murder charges in this case. And although his public defender says there's not enough evidence to connect him to this incident, the judge says the details are horrific and he is a danger to the public. Harold Landon III is being held without bond. What I will say is that we have a strong evidence currently. We think the case will only get stronger. On July 29th, Greenbelt teacher Miriam T. Love was reported missing after she did not return home from her daily walk in Greenbelt. According to court documents, on August 1st, a dismembered body was found near a pond in Clinton. It was later identified as Silas. Court documents say phone records placed Landon at the park at the same time as Sila. And a witness took a photo and told police they saw a white male and pickup truck by the pond on July 31st. The cover up and the attempt uh, to really ensure that no one could identify the body. Um, from my perspective, was deliberate. Landon's public defender says all the evidence against him is circumstantial, but prosecutors believe otherwise. He himself, as well as others that know him, identified him in those photographs. It's very strong evidence. Landon was already behind bars for a domestic case. He's facing assault and robbery charges in two separate incidents involving the mother of his child. But what we do know is that Mr. Landon has a history of abusing women. And now in this case, being led by the county state's attorney, Aisha Brave Boy, he's facing first and second degree murder. I wanted to be a part personally of seeking justice for her and to seek justice for this community. Landon's next court date is scheduled for October. Reporting in Upper Marlboro, Maryland, I'm Yamari Sasseg, DC News Now.